Got some table scraps for my ladies. You my have ladies. ladies. We're keeping them in the in the coop, right? I don't know. What do you think? Yeah, that way they're not in the way of the workers. Uh, the way of the workers. What is she talking about? How could you be in the way of the workers? Check that out. This is the tallest bird aviary. It's actually a greenhouse. We're turning it into a bird aviary. It's the tallest one they've ever done. Tallest one you've ever done, right? right. Tallest one ever. Check that out. They had to bring in a lift just to get the peaks up there. What do you think? Whoa. This is gonna be awesome. Do you like it already? The chicken and peacock are gonna love it. Do you think maybe they'll leave the lift key and you and I can go for a ride tonight? That'll be fun. That's just like a tent pole, huh? Yep. Just gotta fit it right in. Don't let me distract you. <laughs> Giant tent. Wow. There it is. One big giant tent. We can put this anywhere on the property. Maybe maybe we should get one of these in Otter Creek. Yeah. Do you think? Maybe. It's just a giant tent. It's portable. We can take it anywhere. Yeah. We can literally take it anywhere. We can take the poles down at any point in time and take it anywhere we want it to go. What are we doing with this concrete pad? That concrete pad? It stays. Well, you see the pole right there? Yeah. I gotta cut it, that concrete goes bye-bye. This concrete is a run for the chickens to get to the coop. Okay. That's okay? Yeah. You'll I allow it. it? Yep, I love it. The holes here, that's gonna be for specific for post because we're gonna have doors. So there's one here, mm -hmm. there's one here. We'll be able to come inside, but we kept the aviary out there far enough that they'll still get gravel. They need gravel and grit, birds do, to help digest. Right. They also need room. And so we never anticipated keeping the peacocks in here. Uh -uh. We anticipated letting them roam free on the property. That was the dream, is to actually Hi, live babies. your dream every day. To make home a vacation that you never want to leave. So males during, uh, there's this season called mating. Uh-huh. It's like toe mating. Uh-huh. You know, like tomatoes making ketchup. Well, when they want to make ketchup, they get a little territorial. And so, like, you see the males are, are hanging apart right now. They've been yeah. chasing each other for the last 15 minutes. I've been watching them. So this will give them more space. They can dominate different areas. But honestly, they're going to be up in the rafters. They are. But no one puts Elvis in the corner. First thing the crew did was assemble these rafter pieces with all the cross beams. I'm going to get one right now. The reason why this is the biggest and the tallest they've ever put up is because of the chicken coop. We want it to go above the chicken coop. It's going to be okay though, right? Oh, yeah. I'm right in your way, aren't I? <laughs> of course we'll I am. We'll get I'm out right of your way. way here in so a sec. We wanted it so tall so that it would actually go above the chicken coop yep. existing. That way we don't have to build another structure inside. Boss is kicking me out of the way now. I got to go. You see the top of the pole right there? Yeah. That's where the rafter has to come down has to loop over. I'm sure the peacocks are gonna jump on top of the mansion as well. Yes. And if you look straight down here, they'll have about a two foot run there. Mm -hmm. So the, the, all the birds will be able to run through there, which you're gonna let me get more birds now, right? Parrots and... Uh, maybe I'll let you get some quail. Okay, I I'll do take some want quail. some laying hens that lay green eggs and dark brown eggs. What and... about what about the ham? You want green eggs and ham? Yes, please. And then they'll have about two foot over here, maybe a little bit more once we cut that concrete. But the best thing is There'll no be coyotes. more room for activities. No coyotes. We don't have to worry about the coyotes anymore. Do you wanna go camping in this giant tent? Yes, this is a uh, part of phase one, would you say? It is phase one. They're gone as of right now. Peacocks will be roosting up in there, no doubt. So our crew is gone, this yep. is our per this is our tent camping, take it anywhere and go, yep. peacock. No permit needed. 
so we don't have to ask the mayor. Because it is what? Non-permanent. Right. It's a structure that you can move anywhere at any time. So as we go camping and the structure that will cover the current coops. So the peacock playpen. Yes. Uh, what else do we call idea? it? What else do we call it? The peacock what? The, I think we penthouse. Call it the penthouse. The penthouse. This will be a huge chicken mansion, that's for sure. If you thought the chickens were living well before, <laughs> my goodness, they're going to be living well now. There's going to be a lot of mulch in here. They left their machine here. I don't think that's a good idea. Are you serious? That was not a good idea. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> I'll follow your lead. I'm going to try and hijack this machine and see if we can get a video from above. This is going to be incredible. Uh, been a while, but it ain't been that long. What's this thing see. called? This is called a lift. Let's see. Cherry picker? You could call it that. Oh, look at that. <gasps> they left the key, didn't they? Well, I'm actually... Keys are usually on the side. Let's see if I can start it from here. Okay. Let me see. Where should I be standing? Listen. Wait, come on, come on, girl. Oh, almost. Oh, something's flashing over yeah, here. Yeah, it's saying it's unbalanced. Okay. Like like a woman oh. I know. Um, it's, listen to it purr. Whoa, that's not good. <laughs> oh, that's not good at all. Already. What happened there? Okay. okay, where should I be standing right now? Because right now I'm right just kind of standing on, on the edge. I don't know what you're doing. Let's see. Come on, baby. Come on. Okay. Let me see here. Okay. Okay, still getting nowhere. It's been a while. It ain't been that long. Come on, what do I got to do to turn? Am I going to oh, have to look up a YouTube video for you? No. I used to have these all the time when I was building high adventure things. Uh-huh. You're a little but, rusty dog. A little rusty. You think? All right, here's what I think. Okay. Wait, that might be it there. <laughs> Let me see. Let me see. Come on. No. Let's go back down here. Okay, something's got to work. Something. Something, something. I'm definitely looking forward to this thing going up. It's going to be awesome. There. Man, I used to get the ones, I would rent the ones with the key. I'm in full, full rabbit mode. Uh-huh. Nothing, 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 oh, nothing. Oh, look, the toro. We've started it. It's got to be one of the joysticks, no? I got nothing. All right, that doesn't do anything. <laughs> what is going, oh, you know what? I what? bet you it's turned off. There's usually a box on the side. Okay. Like I was saying before, usually you open up on the box on the side. Uh-huh. Let's go. Let's go see if we can find the box, see if we can open this thing up, get it up in the air. Found the key. Okay, that should turn it off. Okay. What will that do? Okay, so they had it here on purpose. Let's start it here. Okay. Okay, I'm trying. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. So you can actually operate it here by doing all this. Uh-huh. All right, I'm going to shut it off. What is that doing? Okay, let's see what we got. You hear it, right? Uh-huh. All right, hold a second. I think I gotta go hit the emergency stop over there. All right, let's see what I got here. Are okay. you moving forward? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, there this. you go. I got this. <laughs> how tall are you gonna go? How high are you gonna go? It's not how high I'm gonna go, it's how high we're gonna go. Okay. Jump inside. You gonna open the door for me? Am I supposed to? Yes, please. Is that the polite thing to do? Yes. All right. We're in the middle of the woods here. You see this flashy light? Yeah. That means we're unbalanced and we could tip over at any time. Okay. That's why it's gonna be so much fun. Whoa, ah! whoa, 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 whoa. That's safety measure right there. <laughs> okay, cool down, cool down. All right, we're cool. See how that did that? Yeah. Never had one like that before. Kind of weird to me. 
Okay. Uh oh. What if I get motion sickness? What if? You will. You already know you this, will. This reminds me of being on the hot air balloon in Egypt. All right, see what just happened? What happened? All right, because we're on uneven ground, yeah. it won't let us go any higher than this. We're barely, we're barely anywhere right now. We gotta get to some level ground <laughs> so that we can go high. I'm so scared right now. When aren't you? You don't trust me driving? No. Is it because I speed in Otter Creek? They call you Captain Fumble Nuts for a reason. Fumble what now? Fumble Nuts. I haven't fumbled anything. I didn't I'm even third. play football. Where are we going? We're going to go see how high. <laughs> <laughs> and we ain't even around. Oh boy. Oh boy. The peacocks are like, uh, what's going on? We gotta go up now. There's a, there's a little bit of a bench. Look over there, there's the eaves right there. Those are the pieces. We gotta go above the bench. Oh my god. I get motion sickness. Already? Already. It doesn't seem that high on camera, but it's really high in person. We're way above the she shed right now. Way above the chicken coop. The chicken mansion. Boy, there's a lot of branches by your head. <laughs> All right, swap me. Okay. We have no harnesses, okay. nothing. You're gonna go over there. We're gonna see how high we can get. Okay. All right. All right, we're going up. We're going up. Up, 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 up. How's the top of the she shed look? It looks clean. Are you ready to crap your pants? Are you? What's that by your head right there? <laughs> A brizzy branch and some leaves. How high wow. do you think we are? I don't know. This is way too high for me right now. Look over there. We're way up in the trees. I can go higher if you want me to. No, no, no. Feel that bounce? Yeah, I don't like that. You like that bounce? No, I don't. Where's oh the my house? God, this is a like a 90, 90 degree angle. Look at the woods down there. Where'd the house go? <laughs> Can't even. George see it. is just freaking I'm out freaking up here. Freaking out right now. No harness. I may seem calm, but We're I'm not. We're up in the trees, literally in the treetops. And I'm just white knuckles right now. We're probably we're knuckles. probably 60 feet up in the woods. If there weren't trees, you could see the house over there. There, that's for the goats when George lets me get them. Even though she claims, what are you doing? I'm scared. What do you think sitting down in a cage is going to do for you? I'm just rocking back and forth. It's because I'm bouncing it. Position. I'm bouncing it. You hear the peacocks? Peacocks are crying out right now. They're, They're sounding like, the alarm. we want a peacock penthouse. Got to take this bad boy back. We don't want the crew knowing that I hijacked it, <laughs> even though I did hijack it. They're, oh, oh nature, you. nature, They're going to know. They're definitely going to know. Look at the tire prints. Well, it's maybe so evident. if somebody, whoa. <laughs> Oh, careful, 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 careful. Ah, branches. The branch. Maybe if somebody knew how to drive around here, it wouldn't be so evident. Maybe if somebody would mow around here, we wouldn't see this four foot tall grass. What's going on with Tap the Tank? I wish I knew. Pat's still in the shop. Apparently getting a makeover, getting all kinds of new plastic parts put on For her. Harry Banana? It's 2023. It's getting mating all season. all kinds of plastic parts. Injections, you name it, Pat the Tank is getting it. And look at the ground, look at the ground! <laughs> Boom! Parked! Just like that. <laughs> they're definitely going to know now they're that never, you ever, hijacked their they're, equipment. They're never going to know. They're totally going to know. Did you what get your is, fix? What is all that? Did you get your this uh, mound of sky power fix? 
I don't know if that's supposed to be mounted yeah, up like that. That's gonna be a problem. I'm pretty sure the crew's gonna know that they didn't leave their equipment like this on the side of the hill. This is how we move cultivators that have been moved with big skid steers. So it's too heavy. It's gotta go in that corner right there for, for decoration for the birds to perch on. This is the Amish way to move it, right? This is an Amish way, I love it. This is his idea, he's the foreman. Now he may look young, but remember, they, they stop after sixth grade and they're full-time tradesmen. So he's the foreman on the project and we all tried to move this thing by hand and we got tired. So he's like, all right, let's move it with the lift. So I tied it up. He's going to get it in. Because the concrete is a good six inches thick here and we have to bust it out, Joe came to save me with some excavation equipment. Joe put this whole pad in as it was anyways and all the mulch. The crew continues to do a great job here, but that pad has to come out for the poles to go in. And then, oh man, and then the net goes over. It's one giant tent for birds. Joe's gonna be saving the day over here, again. Day two of the bird aviary. Phase two? No, day two, phase? but you have doors. These are Except cool. they don't open. Uh-oh. Not, not yet. Here, let me show you, let me show you how to get through. Okay. You put one step over, <laughs> just like that. Here's our poles right here. Okay. If you look up top, this is why this is the largest, the tallest bird aviary. It's actually a greenhouse, but bird aviary they've ever constructed because we wanted it to go over the existing chicken, chicken mansion. mansion. Yeah. Hey, babies. And... Hi, pigeon-looking chicken. The peacock... Hello, babies. Penthouse. So right now, you can see it does. Yeah. And what we've done, if you look out here, we've kept all the shade. Mm -hmm. So the birds will have all the shade that they need during any given time of the year. Right. And what they have is a couple feet of a run here. Yep. Let's go. Let's That'll run obviously here. be cleared once it's all erect. Uh, speaking of cleared, uh -huh. this isn't clear, be careful. Okay, I'll Be watch careful. my step. So they will have... Hi, babies. The doors will be open full yeah. time, year yep. round. We'll never have to close the doors again. Correct. So they'll have this as a chicken run as well. Okay. Are you running with me? I'm or, coming. Or... So, oh, here I come. <laughs> oh, really? It sounds like you're falling. <laughs> so they'll be able to run on either side. Yep. And then... He's talking already. Then, all right, show you what else we've done. We had all these rocks in here at one point. Me and Christian pulled them all in. Yeah. And I got more vines over there, but we had to move all of that for all of this mulch to get in mm -hmm. because this is clay. Right. So under this is clay, and the birds can't get a good dirt bath in just clay. Clay just doesn't dust up. It's just... Mm -hmm. The other thing, you're going to love it. Oh, look at that. You see that, right? Oh, I see it the already. The old cultivator. I'm putting old farm equipment inside and the birds can actually roost on it. But they actually love it. Let's they, be they honest. Use it as a playground now. The birds, they're gonna be roosting up in here. All up in here. I mean the peacocks are gonna be up there. Chickens are gonna be trying to get up there. You think I'm spoiled now? Our yeah. feathered babies are gonna be spoiled. I do too. think you're spoiled. But we've got natural stones in here. All of this will be for landscaping. I really want it to feel like the jungle. Like, welcome mm -hmm. to the jungle. They're going to love it. I love it already. You know what I'm thinking, George? What are you thinking, Lincoln? Another ride. No. The bird aviary is officially complete. We've got the whole tent poles and all of the netting. It may be hard to see, but this is what we have. We have a two inch netting double knot right there. Mm -hmm. Now, the small little creatures we're not gonna be able to keep out. To keep the big creatures out, we actually put a baseboard around everything. I've gotta put some more stone in here so that raccoons and possums won't get in there, but I think George is actually ready to let the birds out. I can't believe it, the day is here. Do I need a secret knock? I don't know. 
I bet you can't even figure out how to open it. Oh, maybe you can. Okay. You slide it up and then slide it over. All right. Okay. What am What am I gonna do in here? I'm gonna close this so that the birds don't uh, don't escape. Okay. You didn't close it, and you still didn't. I'm and still learning. Still learning. There now it's go. closed. There now it's go. closed. Hi, fluffy bugs. Look at them. They're eager. They're eager to come out. Yeah. Well, pigeon-looking chicken will probably get through one of those Release holes down there. The fluffy bugs. And. Okay, how's everybody feeling about the new digs? Yeah, I know there's dirt in your gravel. You're not even gonna go look at your backyard? They need to follow me. Follow me. Come on, babies. Follow me. Come on, babies. Follow me. Yeah, they didn't want nothing to do with that. They're like, eh, you know what? We'll stay here. Come on, babies. They're like, me. where's the peacocks? Take us to that leader. Where's the peacocks? They're all going to the peacocks right now. They don't want nothing to do with George. Uh-oh, they're going to their backyard. I'll be with you guys in just a moment. They're oh, going to their backyard. Uh, I'm going to need a ladder to take that netting down. Okay. No more netting. Complete and total freedom. Freedom! Go, little lady. Find your sisters. I'm pretty sure... They're all taking a dirt bath. Pretty sure they are. Elvis is trying to show off to the chickens. Hey. Whenever you mix peacocks oh. and chickens, he just went down. You've got a um, you got kind of a dangerous mix for disease for for the peacocks, not for the chickens. Mm -hmm. So if they get into if they get into the chicken poo, they can get different diseases which aren't good for them. But we've got antibiotics. Well, it's not even antibiotics. It's all for one. We already have it. Uh, it's down in the mailbox, actually. So, it's a good day for this to all happen. Mm -hmm. You coming inside with me? Yeah. Would you like me to? No. But hey, what's going to happen? You're, you're going to do it anyway, aren't you, George? I'm going to follow you. You're going to do it anyway. Because that's what I do. So, what we're going to do is, once and for all, take the net down. This will still be the peacock home, and in their brain, they'll know it's home. Mm -hmm. But they'll still get to fly. They'll be up on top of the actual structure. They'll be in the rafters. They'll be everywhere. It's going to be fun to see. There they go. The net's down, and there oh, they go. Who was the first one out? And one of the females. Elvis is staying behind. He is. Elvis is like, He's being bashful. Uh -uh. I'm hanging out in the jailhouse rock. <laughs> they took our birding bench out. We can't get this along the sides. What are we gonna do? What do you think? What are you thinking? I ain't taking the netting off. It's an expensive structure for birds. Mm. What are you thinking? There's a door on the other end. That's why we paid for two doors. <laughs> What's behind you? Ha ha! Is it even safe? It's very safe to come in. The chicken are to the left of the mansion. The peacocks. And the peacocks and are just following the chicken. No, the peacocks are attacking the chickens right They now. are? This is going to be interesting. This is like when I met George, a fight for domination. She had to be in control of everything. We're going to find out who wins. All this space. Look at that. Look at all that space. All of this space. And what did they do? went right back to home. They went right back into the coop and into the peacock playpen. It's gonna take some time for them to adjust. It's like, it's like getting a child a Christmas gift and all they wanna play with is the box. The chickens are in the peacock playpen and the peacocks are checking out the chicken mansion. Wouldn't you know it, all they wanted to do was swap places. This is ridiculous. Hey, hey, don't run. Maybe do run. Go see what's out there. Go play. Go play. Go play, Elvis. Go play. Come on, go play. Go do something. Come on. Fly, you guys can fly now. You guys can fly, get up there in those roosts. Have some fun. Yeah, we're gonna make a beautiful rock pile for you to climb on.